Hi everyone, it's Make and Makeup Twin here. So today I'm doing a eye look. It's like a very soft baby eye look, I guess. I'm not for sure what I'm going to call it. Maybe um, summer eye look. I'm not for sure. It's just a very soft pink with a little bit of darker pink and green. Um, sorry if you see my sister in the background. I guess she don't want to get out of my room. So yeah. Um, the palette I'm using is from Rummel London and it's 106 um, Urban Flower. There we go. So the first thing I'm going to do is take my Oh, prime your eyelids first. I already primed my eyelids, and that's why it looks like I already have a little bit of stuff on my eyelids. Um, it's just a Kat Von D and High Voltage Eyelid Primer. I like this eyelid primer because it blocks out all the darkness, um, veins in your eye. It just gives you a, f like, fresh, clean base to start with. I'm going to take this, um, pinky, creamy color right here. Well, it's not creamy, but it's just, like, a light pinky. I'm going to put that all over my lid. And I like that eye primer, um, another reason why is when I put it on and it enhances my eyeshadow so much. Like it just makes the colors even more brighter than they are. And put that color in your inner tear duct. And just focus this color on your lower lid. Don't hardly go into the crease, but if you go into the crease that will be okay. It's not like you have to freak out or anything, but yeah. So it just looks like that. Sorry if I'm like cupping my eye for you guys to see. It's like not really sunny outside so I have to like film with my um selling light on and it just doesn't work the next thing the next color we're going to take is we're going to take this and I'm taking my elf blending eye brush and I'm gonna put some of this on there and I'm just gonna blend that into my inner into my crease And just keep working that in and kind of blend it in with that pearly color we just put on, that baby pink. And I'm going to take more of that and I'm going to blend that in even more. So this kind of, it's like a light brown with like pink in it. It's like pink brown. It's really weird, but it's a very beautiful color. I hardly use this palette, so it's good that I'm, or trio, whatever you want to call it. It's good that I'm getting use out of it. So just work that into your um, crease. I'm going to take more and work it on the outer half and kind of make a V with it because I think that fits my eye shape better. Just keep on blending. Um, the next color I'm going to take is the green color. This one right here. And I'm going to blend that in with it as well. But I'm only going to keep this on the outer half. And this color is pigmented. So I'm only going to take a little bit of this. And I'm just going to kind of work up with it. And then into the crease just a little bit. As you guys can see I'm staying on the outer half. And this just puts the color direct into that spot. So let's get a little bit more. And this just gives the eye more depth. And I think it's very pretty. This is definitely like a spring summer eye. I mean, I'm actually going to take some more of that green and blend it into this one. There we go. Um, the next color I'm going to take is not from this palette. It's from my uh, Maybelline Sunbaked Naturals. I'm just going to take that cream color as I always do and that's going to be my highlight. Just take um, any color that matches your skin tone and put it on. Um, the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to curl my eyelashes. And this is the e.l.f. eyelash curler. This is their $1 one. I'm just going to curl my eyelashes. Um, the next thing I am taking is my mascara. This is just the e.l.f. Uh, original Waterproof Mascara Duo. I'm going to take the original side and I'm going to put a couple coats of this on my top and bottom lashes. And you can put eyeliner on with this. I'm just not going to because I'm not really good at putting on eyeliner and I just don't want to ruin the look. But um, you can even add it to the bottom. I was thinking about adding a very light green to the bottom onto the outer half. But I'm just not going to do it. There we go. So I'll get all up close and personal and show you guys. 
So it's just a very simple eye with the pearl color on the lid and then just the darker pink worked into the crease. As you guys can see, it just forms my eye. And then I have the green on the outer part right here, as you guys can see. And that just adds more color. So there we go. And it would be really cool if you guys um, would do like a winged out eyeliner. I think that would be very pretty as well. And then just finish off with your lips and cheeks. And I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Bye.